human and business are not separate. Some case, business need an inventory or even warehouse to store the goods or product. Because of that, the warehouse has a vital role in the logistics system to fulfill customer demand and service successfully. Like in this warehouse case of iLocos LTD, iLocos LTD is a third-party logistic company that handles finished goods owned by XYZ LTD. Types of goods dealt with are fast-moving customer goods. So let we check the inbound and outbound process between the XYZ LTD company and uh, iLocos LTD company and the customer. First, it began with XYZ LTD by sending their goods or product to the iLocos LTD warehouse to be stored. And when the retailer as a customer want to order some product, the customer will send the order by form purchase order document to XYZ LTD. And XYZ LTD will send the sales order to the iLocos LTD to begin the operation in warehouse to deliver the product. When iLocos warehouse delivery arrive in customer, the customer will receive the goods from the XYZ LTD and the outbound is done. It looks simple, right? Yes, it is. It looks simple, but it's not. Now, take a look at this. From the late of picking and put away activity, we can conclude that the delay occurs due to upstream activity the second is random put away it means goods are only placed in empty location without considering proper storage location this causes a domino effect when the picking process and the third is operator operator have to look for product ordered by a consumer which cause high packing activity and the last is warehouse is the low accuracy of the inventory between the actual amount and the number of item record in the information system. The solution for the random putaway is each product is grouped into rack according to their SKU code. Because each bay has its own SKU code, we have named each bay so it is easier to record the SKU code into the bay. This is the table of each bay with its SKU code that we calculated. The following is an example of the implementation of this table. For example, bay A is filled by three SKU code, which is AA1, AA2, and AA3. We suggest that XYZ LTD to reduce the number of goods of inbound because of we assume that the optimal state of stock in the iLocos warehouse is 30% more than the, uh, the total to outbound. In this case, the amount of stock still greatly excess 30% of the total outbound so that it will cause the possibility of a dead stock. The next solution that we suggest is to take advantage of technology adaptation. first technology is the RFID. RFID is a radio frequency identification. It's the technology which use radio frequency to identify object and transfer data by the wireless non-contact and it can be automatically tracked and traced on each product, item or pallet by using the RFID tag. RFID technology consists of antenna, RFID reader, and RFID tag. So, we can put RFID reader in inbound, racking, and outbound. So, when the product with RFID tag pass through inbound, racking, and outbound field of the scanning antenna, it will automatically detect the product. So, it will reduce time, increase the accuracy of inventory between actual amount and number of item record, and last is remove human error. Now, 
check this video. And returns to work. 24-7 passive RFID readers automatically record whenever RFID tag inventory enters or leaves the smart zone. Inventory. The next technology is the smart glasses, also known as efficient picking. Enable employee of the warehouse to work having their hands free in order to do their operation easier. Employee sees in their glasses a visual display with the picking instruction, including information about the progress, location, quantity, or the next pick. Also, the smart glasses can display map which is the best route for the one-way picking. This is not the only advantage of these glasses. In fact, productivity can improve around 15% on average. Now, check this video. Incoming pick request for customer 351. 22 items, please confirm. Confirmed. Show me the pick list. Go to aisle 17, shelf 3. Show item 1. The size for item 1 is 30 by 25 by 5 and the weight of 0.5 kg. It's non-fragile. Pick 2. So, by using the solution we described, the iLocos LTD company will be able to increase the key performance indicator so that the KPI reach the target which is 95%. So keep innovating and thank you very much.